Dr. Paul here. We've got a young man with a horrible cough. And it's been going on for, has it been a month? Is that what I heard? A month. Your cough's been getting worse. That's right. what you were telling me. Yeah. And you've had fever to 101 and a half roughly for the last three days, right? In addition to the cough, you had a slight sore throat. You had strep throat going around your school. At the school, right. At the school for the last couple weeks. And this ear looks perfect. It's perfect. Ah. Uh, Good job. So, one more time. We would need an x-ray to look at my brain. We would need an x-ray. Like, it's called an MRI or a CT scan, something like that. Bigger. And again. Again. Wow. For the viewers, what I am hearing when I'm listening in his right upper lobe, right lower lobe, totally clear. The air goes. No, it comes right not. up. When I listen on this other side, the right upper lobe, and especially the right lower lobe, hardly hear any sound at all. Crackle, crackle, crackle. That's what we call RALS, which is the sound we get when you have pneumonia. And that's exactly what's going on. You have a left-sided pneumonia, especially left lower lobe. When you have pneumonia on both sides of your lungs, it well, could be viral, it could be pertussis, well, which is whooping cough. Be, what will happen if you eat it? Well, this isn't edible. This is just a Do you know what happens if you eat it? <laughs> Um, no, I've never tried. Open your mouth for me. Stick it out further and say, ah. Uh, good. Okay, so what you notice there, folks, is how to quickly swab the side of the throat. As long as you get some stuff off the tonsils. For the viewers, we have to treat this with antibiotics. A bacterial pneumonia is not something you want to just sort of watch. This is one of those instances where antibiotics, thank goodness, are available to us and effective. I suspect it'll be strep. I'm not sure this will still be positive but we're gonna treat him with amoxicillin. One might make a case for going amox clavulinic, which is augmentin, but this young man I already know has a terrible time taking liquids. So I think by going amoxicillin chewable high dose, 90 per kilo, we're gonna get him well. And of course we'll be monitoring closely and if by any chance you're not getting better, you'll come back and see me, right? Okay. He does feel quite hot, folks. He has 101 and a half temperature right now as we speak. So this is very brave of you to share your experience with us. What you watch for, if you have a pneumonia that's getting worse, the cough is getting worse, you're going to uh, potentially have these high fevers that don't go away. They're actually getting worse. There you go. Good job covering your mouth. Thanks for sharing. Thanks for watching. Take care.